student today we will see the case 3 of regrouping of 100 tens and ones okay so see case 3 is that when you have more than 10 tens and 10 ones if you have more than 10 tens and 10 ones okay so three this is the ones column this is the tens column and this is the hundreds column okay so how many ones are there one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve ones are there okay how many tens are there one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten tens are there and we have to regroup this ten tens and twelve ones into hundreds tens and ones okay so see first you have to start from ones column okay so how many ones are there 12 ones are there okay so you know that 10 ones is equal to 110 okay 10 ones is equal to 110 so this 10 ones collect and make one tens here okay 10 okay so see here what we have done there are 12 ones okay so we know that 10 ones is equal to 110 so we collect this 10 blocks and we form one tens here and that one tens we ship, shifted in the tens column okay so now how many tens form here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 tens are form here and how many ones left here two ones left here okay so now next step is that you know that 10 tens is equal to 100 10 tens is equal to 100 so this 10 tens you have to shift into the 100 column okay so in next we have shown it see here 100 we have shifted to 100 uh, column then here one tens remains and two ones remains okay so see 10 tens and 12 ones we regroup into 100 1 10 and two ones and which number form here one at the hundred place one at the ten place and two at the one place so 112 number is form okay. we'll solve some example on regrouping okay so instruction regroup and write the numerals 7 10 and 12 ones okay so we have to regroup this 7 tens and 12 ones into the 100 tens and ones column okay so see here 12 ones okay first we will start from ones place okay so 12 ones means how many tens and how many ones okay so we know 10 ones 10 ones is equal to 110 okay see here 10 ones is equal to 110 and 10 tens is equal to 100 remember this okay so 7 tens and 12 ones so first regroup this 12 ones into how many tens and how many ones so 12 ones means 1 10 and 2 ones okay that 2 ones you have to write in that ones place okay write this two at the one place okay now this one ten you have to add into this seven tens okay this one ten you have to add into seven tens so seven ten plus one tens how much total eight tens okay here you have to write eight okay so now eight tens and two ones so which number form eighty two number is form okay then 12 tens and 16 1 12 tens and 16 ones okay so first regroup this 16 ones into how many tens and how many ones so 16 ones means 1 10 and 6 ones okay 
16 ones means 1 tens and 6 ones. So this 6 ones write into ones column or ones place. Okay. Then this 1 ten you have to add into 12 tens. Now how many tens are there? 13 tens. Okay. If we add 1 tens into 12 tens we will get 13 tens. Now we know 10 tens is equal to 100. Okay. So 13 tens is equal to 100 and 3 tens. Okay. 100 and 3 tens. So which number form here? 136. 136. Okay. If you know how many ones is equal to 110 and how many tens is equal to 100, then you can do it okay then c1 200 16 tens and 18 ones okay 200 16 tens and 18 ones you have to always start from the ones place okay so regroup this 18 ones into how many tens and how many ones so 18 ones means 1 10 and 8 ones okay so that 8 ones you, you have to write here at the ones place okay and then this 110 you have to add into this 16 okay so how many tens now 16 plus 1 17 tens okay now we know 10 tens means 100 okay so this again this 17 tens we can regroup into see here i'm here showing 17 tens is equal to 107 okay 17 tens means 107 tens so now this 7 tens right here okay and this 100 add into this 200 so 2 plus 100 300 so now which number form here 378 378 okay once again i am explaining this this okay regroup and write the numeral okay so what what to do here 7 10 and 12 ones so we have to regroup this 7 tens and 12 ones into how many tens and how many ones okay so 12 ones first you have to start from ones place. So 12 ones means 110 and 2 ones. So we have written this 2 here at the ones place. Okay. Then this 110 we have added into 7 tens. Okay. So 7 plus 1, 8. Okay. Then in next example, there are 12 tens and 16 ones. So first regroup this 16 ones into how many tens and how many ones. So 16 tens means 1 tens and 6 ones. So we have written this 6 here and 110 we have added into 12 so 12 plus 1 13 tens okay 12 plus 1 13 tens and this 13 tens we again regroup into how many hundred and how many tens okay so see here we know 10 tens 10 tens means 100 so 13 tens means 100 and 3 tens so we have written here 103 tens okay in next example 216 tens and 18 ones okay so first we regroup this 18 ones 18 ones means 110 and 8 ones so we have written this 8 at the one place then what we have done this 110 we added into 16 tens so 16 plus 110 17 10 okay so again with this, this 17 tens regroup into how many hundred and how many tens okay so see here 17 tens means 100 okay i have shown here 17 tens means 100 and 7 tens so this 7 i have written here and this 100 i added into 200 we got 300 so 300 7 tens and 8 ones so so this 378 number we got